Hi guys, my name is Michael Okunoro and this is my YouTube channel. If you're meeting me for the first time, this is the day 17 of my 21 days vlogging challenge that I've said to myself that I'll face my peers to show up on camera every day to teach either about fashion or share of my daily activities. And today I have a tutorial for you on how to style a beige suit. Um, by the way, I am the creative director of a men fashion brand called 1219 Styles. We're based in London and in Lagos. And I'm about to show you five different ways you can style this beige suit. This beige, this is just a jacket. So with the trouser, it gives you a complete suit. This is a single button beige jacket with pointed lapel. So today I'll be showing you five different ways you can style this color of suit. But first and first, anytime you want to style a suit or you want to dress up a suit, there are some things you need to consider. Number one, you need to consider the look you're going for. Are you going for a formal look or are you going for informal look? Is it a smart casual look you're going for? For the first look for today, I, I chose to go for a smart casual look, which means it is not formal. I'm trying to dress smart and a bit casual. So, which brings us to our first look for the day. Outside you looking at the look you want to go for, you also want to look for, you also want to think about the colors that complement this jacket you're styling. For example, this is a beige jacket. We want to think about what other colors can I match with this beige jacket that will make sense, that it is going to look good. We want to look at colors like blue. You want to look like you want to look at colors like tan. You want to look at green. You want to look at brown. All these colors, when we bring them together and we match them with this beige jacket, it is going to give us a great outcome. You also want to consider the event you're wearing it for, the occasion. Are you a wedding guest? Are you going to office? Are you going for a formal meeting? That, that as well play a larger part or a larger role in the outfit selection, in, in, in the color selection of your outfit. Because you don't want to go to a wedding looking, you don't want to dress up going for a wedding in, a, in an outfit that is supposed to be for an office or rather going to the office in a wedding attire it just does not make any sense you have to dress right for the occasion you're going to so we will get into it very first look for this we're going for a smart casual look we picked a darker brown trouser checkered trouser match it with a light blue with a light blue shirt and also I have this other shade of blue, darker shade of blue um, vests and I have my white sneakers on so the white sneakers make it more casual I can as well switch this look up with a black shoe and I'll have more formal look One of the reason I picked this look is for me to as well play with colors for me to create something different just for me to match up with the colors and um, the, the play of color here is me matching this beige jacket with a brown trouser and also me matching the sky blue shirt with the blue vest. So let me know what you think about this look. Second look, I decided to go for a formal look. I have my blue shirt to match up with my blue tie. I chose a deeper shade of blue just to contrast the light blue shirt and i've as well carefully picked this pocket square the pocket square is it, it is white but it has red and blue details in it so the idea of this pocket square is for you to contrast the tie and the shirt and as well stay neutral to the suit i am wearing and also i have picked a brown shoe just to match the beige jacket and also with a blue polka dot socks to match up with my tie. So, for the top look, I have alternated the blue shirt for a pink shirt, then with a blue 
tie as well and if you look carefully on my blue tie there is a pink details that is coordinating with a pink shirt and as well with my blue pocket square and with the po and, and with the blue details on the pocket square so with this we've created another formal look if you're a 95 person this is your perfect go-to look and again so far so good this is my favorite look i just love how i've been able to match and blend about four different four to five different colors together and they are all going well so i have my white trouser matching with the shirt with the white lines of the shirt i have the pocket square as well the pocket in the pocket square you have all the details you have the blue you have the red you have the white which perfectly sits well or blends well with my shirt and my trouser and also the pink in it also matches with the socks with the pink and white polka dots <laughs> so, so so far so good this is like my favorite look i just love how i've been able to blend about four to five colors together yes you have the blue you have the white you have the pink you have the tan you have the you have the brown you have the beige you have everything in it and yes they are all coming all along together you know, this is a look you can wear as well i would like to know in the comment section if it is just me or yes if you if you're feeling what i'm feeling as well let me know in the comment section this is the fifth look i have come up with this is a perfect blend of black trouser black striped shirt um, with the white details the white details is just to bounce off the beige suit itself and as well to just pick attention or to pick the details of the pocket square you can wear this to work you can wear these as a wedding guest or as an event guest in general let's say you're attending a seminar this is a perfect look that you can wear and the whole idea of me creating this look is to be able to inspire you to follow this principle to create your own look as well so you can with a big suit you can create as numerous look as you want so far you just follow the same principle look at the color that contrasts beige look at the color that complements bridge and always put in mind the events you're going for so that as well determine what you're going to come up with so thank you so much i'll see you tomorrow for day 18. please do subscribe to my youtube channel thank you